sight in the game to see the boxing boys. What are, all, what are all these belts? Well, this one I won it in 2005 at Oakland Arena. Um, fought for a eight a uh, a rounder for you know for this I guess it's a state title. Um, this one I went to Guyana and um, won the WIBF. I believe it was 2008. And then of course this is my my main one right here. I love this one, the green one, the WBC world title. Um, that's your face. Uh, yeah, you know, shoot, finally my face is in one of these belts, too, you know? And um, that's the best one. I, I always wanted this one. I fought Bandit Wars like three times, and I could never get this one. So now came back out of retirement and fought the world title and, and got it now. Now I got to come back and defend my title. Somebody wants this green baby right here, which I'm not going to let go. Uh, hopefully I retire and still have it. But one fight at a time. I'm getting ready for November 7th. Um, fighting, can I don't know yet who it is. We'll give you more information later on. Make sure that everything is said. But that's why we're here right now, trying to get the work in and get ready for November 7th. Something being around uh, the beautiful brawlers, I, I notice that like uh, oftentimes people don't appreciate women's boxing. How much does it mean to be uh, what most people consider the most prestigious belt, the WBC champion? Go to events, WBC events, where you're around basically all the best in the world, yeah. and people walk up to you and introduce to you as "Hey, champ." Yeah. What does that mean to you? Hey, champ, man. That means well to me. It means the world. You know, uh, it's not easy to have this WBC world title. And uh, when we went to the WBC convention in Las Vegas, man, that was that was the the one day in my life that was it was just incredible. Uh, we Blanca and I had so much fun, and um, we had a blast. We met all the the WBC World Champions, females and males. So it was an amazing day. But you know, uh, it's this is my joy right here, this spell right here, and I'm gonna keep it until I retire. And uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Who were you most, uh, who did it mean the most to meet when you were at the WBC event? Because uh, it's your best day ever. Yeah, you know what? All the old boxers, uh, Holofield was there, De La Hoya, you know, Mayweather, I didn't get close to him. But um, just meeting them, it was just an amazing, amazing time. Um, Cesar, uh, Julio Cesar Chavez, too, was there. So I met him. So, you know, Triple G, all the new ones, too, you know. But so, I mean, everybody, just basically all the champions, you know that were there, it was an amazing day. And is there a venue or any specifics for November 7th? Um, right now, uh, there is, but I can't say much. We gotta make sure that uh, the person that I'm fighting has everything, all the paperwork done and ready to go, and then we'll, we'll come out and say something to the media and tell them who's gonna be, and what day and when. Well, we already know the day, but when and where, and so we'll, we'll keep you informed.